Good morning. I'm Carlton Sharp, pastor of Faith Christian Center Church right here in Beaumont, Texas. And we're here on what's happening in our neighborhood. And today my special guest is Miss Caroline Brandon. Welcome, Caroline. Hello, thank you. Hey, <laughs> tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, my name is Caroline Brandon, and I was born and raised right at your neighbors, Port Arthur, Texas. What? I'm a graduate of Thomas Jefferson High School. So uh, uh, this is my community. TJ, huh? Town. Yes, sir. <laughs> Yellow jackets. <laughs> Yellow jackets. Yes. So, so tell us, what are you doing now? I uh, actually I uh, work for GTEC Golden Triangle Empowerment Center. Um, we're an industrial training center. Um, we've been around since 07, and we assist the community in getting these industrial jobs. So, 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 what are some of the uh, things that you provide uh, here in, in the local area? Okay, so first I'm gonna start off with we also in partnership with Lamar University CICE. It's a new building on the yeah, campus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I talked to somebody before they got all of them. C I C E D F G F and all of that. <laughs> yeah, it's a new building at the Lamar University campus and it stands for the Center of Innovation, Commercialization, and Entrepreneurship. Okay. But they mainly focus on the workforce training part. That's where we partner up with them. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so so you help people get prepared to go into the refineries, is that correct? Yes. But we also start off with uh, soft skills, which is called the life skills and critical thinking. That's the first two weeks, and that's at the Lamar campus at the C I C E building. When you go into the second phase to the NCCR, which is the construction part, which stands for the National Center of Education Research, you go to the Port Arthur building. Uh huh. Yes. So, so you actually have two locations that you provide this education, basically. Yes. Right. Yes. So we start off at Lamar University, and then we go to the G Tech building in Port Arthur. So, what are some of the benefits of G Tech for the community? Well, we have a lot of complaints about out of towners taking all the jobs. So we want to assist those people that may have had a lot of industrial experience but never got the certification. And we're also branching off into getting additional certification so that they can get that. They, we want to get them to the journeyman level so that those jobs can come to our people in the community. So what do you mean by certification? So like I said, the NCCER is a National Center of Re Education Research. And that's what employers look for. It's a certification that it, it, it's like a, um, you don't have to renew it. It's not like an ISTC where you have to go refresh it. Once you get it, it's yours. You can go back. So if you get an associate's degree, you can go back and get a bachelor's or whatever. You don't have to go back and refresh it. Okay. So it's always there. You just build on it. So if you start off with the core, which is what we offer, then you could go to a helper one level, a helper two, and work your way up to that journeyman level. Now, is this like uh, in welding or, or electronics or things like that? Yeah. We do introduction to welding, carpentry, electrical. So you get a little taste of all of it, scaffolding, and in that way for maybe those that have never been in industry, they can see where they actually fit in that because just because your uncle was a welder don't mean you can be a welder yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> so once you done tried it you can say no that ain't for me so yeah it introduced you to those different crafts so so when it comes down to uh how, how long are the courses okay it's eight to ten weeks so the first two weeks which is the life skills and the critical thinking and then the next seven to eight weeks is the actual construction phase okay and so now now do you partner with the student to help provide them uh, placement uh, placement yes. yes sir we do but it's like the only thing we offer is your commitment so in that phase those little things that we need you to do give us a resume we help you with your resume writing you know a lot of people can't fill out an application and that's the first thing an employer looks at yeah. when they want a resume you have to have a good resume you may forget some things that you need to put on there that you actually know how to do so we try to help them in them areas so that they can get them jobs and their applications and their resumes won't be looked over so, so okay, uh, so a person comes for eight to ten weeks. Yes. Okay, and in that process, you're helping them not only with applications uh, and, and resumes. resumes, but you're also teaching them a craft. Yes, and we assist them with job placement. Some of our students get placed while they're in class. We partnership wow. with a lot of contractors in the area that want our students. So I always tell them, take this serious and do the best you can so that that next person, your nephew, your cousin, or whatever that's coming up behind you will get that same opportunity. Because there, I, uh, people always complain about Caroline that there are no jobs. There are jobs out there. They are. Yeah. We also assist with, you know, drug counseling. We have places that we send them to if they, because we do drug test them. You know, but we're second chance programs. So if you fail, we're not going to kick you out. But we do offer you and send you to places that can help you with that because you have to pass a back, uh, background and a drug test. Right, right. Okay. Now, now you said it was the, the class were from eight to ten weeks, right? Mm -hmm. What what times and what days of the week are those classes? They're Monday through Thursday. Okay. We have a morning class from 9 a.m. to 12 noon, and then we have an evening class 
from 6.30 to 9.30 p.m. And it's Monday through Thursday. So if you say you have a day job, you can go at night. And if you're working at night, you can come in the day. Wow. Yeah. So, so I mean, so really there's no excuse for, no. for we <laughs> even try. We're even trying to work in a one to four one just in case. So you know. basically a three-hour class. It's three hours, yes, sir. For, mm -hmm. for eight to ten weeks. Yes, sir. So, so now when does those classes uh, begin? Well, we actually have another one that's starting on August the 14th. And okay. that one starts at Lamar, but we also have the second phase one that we're also starting at the GTEC building. For all those classes that have already finished, they'll be rolling into the second phase. So if a person watching today want to be a part of these classes, what do they need to do and who do they need to contact? Well, they can contact myself, Caroline Brandon, or Brandy Simmons. And uh, we do start off, like I said, at the Lamar. So the number is 409-880-7108. And that's for the Lamar CIC, where it all starts off at. Yeah. Now, now did, did, did we say the cost of these classes? Yes, it's their commitment. It's their There's commitment. There's no cost, but a commitment. Hold on, Carolyn. It's free if it they just commit free. themselves to coming for those eight to ten weeks. Yes, sir. Yes. No charge. No, sir. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so really, really, there is no excuse, you know. Exactly. So you're talking if, okay, okay, let me just do some math real quick. Three hours a, a day time, uh, four days a week, yeah, that's 12. Yeah, because we don't take your Friday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got yeah. a three-day weekend. <laughs> <laughs> saying, you ain't going to take my Friday, brother. <laughs> yeah. So, so you're going to put 12 hours in that week. Yes, sir. You know, for, for ten, eight to ten weeks. Mm -hmm. Wow. And you can come out and go and work in one of the refineries. All this construction that's going on, yeah. that's a grand opportunity. Yes, there's a lot of expansions going on. A lot. Well, listen, I want to thank Caroline for coming, Caroline for coming today and talking mm -hmm. to us about uh, the GTEC, you know, GTEC uh, <laughs> uh, opportunities that you have. Again, the information is there on the screen. Listen, if you want to be placed in one of these refinery jobs, this is a great start. This is the place to start. Uh, to working on getting the opportunity to get in. Uh, it's absolutely free. It's no cost to you. It only takes your commitment. You have to be committed to going on a daily basis, Monday through Thursday, uh, at least three hours a day to get certified. And they will certify you and help you get placed in one of those refinery jobs. So I want to thank her again for coming today. And I want to yes. thank you for joining us on What's Happening in Our Neighborhood. And we will see you next time on the air.